Well, New Jersey is the 13th state to legalize recreational marijuana, but some people don't want it in their backyards. News 12 New Jersey's Naomi Yane tells us about the pot pushback in one town. The bill signed into law by Governor Murphy not only legalized marijuana, but also decriminalized the possession of small amounts. In Wayne Township, Mayor Chris Vergano says... We don't want it here. The town council is proposing a full-on ban on the retail sale of marijuana. We just don't believe it's worth the effort and the time and what would take of our community and what our community could become. In the township of 55,000 people, over 18,000 residents voted yes okay. to legalizing marijuana in November. I thought that would be great for the economy because the tax revenue from marijuana would be used for several like state programs. However, on March 3rd, an ordinance that bans retail stores from setting up shop in Wayne was introduced a duplicate ordinance from over a year ago that included changes due to the new regulations. What we did was just reemphasize and did the same thing that we did a year and a half ago um, by just stating publicly that we don't want any of the six categories. Those categories include cultivators, manufacturers, wholesalers, retailers, testing facilities, product testing, and medical dispensaries. Towns like Patterson have seen an increase in revenue and have even partnered with dispensaries who promise local jobs. Mayor Vergano estimates a 2% increase if marijuana shops are allowed to set up shop in Wayne. However, he's willing to take the L with this ban. Retail legislation gave towns like Wayne 180 days to pass an ordinance either approving or disapproving marijuana sales. If you don't act in that 180 day window, you have a five-year moratorium of when you can't stop them. There'll be a public hearing on April 7th. Reporting in Wayne, Naomi Yane, News 12, New Jersey.